Hi there everyone, my name is Lyric. Welcome back to my channel. Today I would like to do a tarot love reading for the sun sign of Sagittarius. We're going to look at um, both energies, the masculine and the feminine. The cards have been shuffled. I'm going to use different cards actually. I must use those ones, but I'm going to use these ones instead, okay? So I've got the Six of Pentacles, the Justice card, wow, the Three of Swords, and the Queen of Cups. So I'm getting that um, there um, after some heart, that balance is coming through in this connection after some heartbreak. Um, it could have been in the past that um, the Divine Feminine was um, holding herself back, was holding her feelings back, that she was afraid to, um, to sort of expose herself um is what i'm getting um but there is a sense of um, balance being restored in this connection i know that with the six of pentacles and the justice card here um together um let's get because this this three of swords here doesn't make that much sense so let's pull some clarifying cards so I hope that everyone's doing well. If you're watching this video and you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please subscribe to my channel. If you're interested in booking a personal reading with me, um, check out my description box for all those details, okay? Oh, so let's get some more. Not those ones, too many. So I'm using Everyday Tarot to clarify. I like the mini decks because they're easier for me to shuffle. I have small hands and it's hard to shuffle the bigger cards but I got these my daughter actually got these for me for my birthday um okay let's clarify the ace of pentacles the six of pentacles to clarify the justice card the eight of swords to clarify the three of swords and the nine of pentacles to clarify the queen of cups so I'm getting that there was this, um, there was a, in, in the recent past a separation from the divine feminine. The divine feminine walked away from the connection, um, didn't like feeling vulnerable, didn't want to get too involved, wanted to kind of um, keep herself together is what I'm getting. And um, she took the time to... Um, to evaluate the connection to, um, and I'm getting that when she was in separation from this person, they're not in separation at this time, that, um, that she was experiencing a lot of heartache. And I think that she didn't know about her own true feelings for this person. And so she didn't want to lead this person on. She's not that kind of woman. So, um, she pulled her energy away, which caused the eight of swords and this three of swords here. So a lot of pain, a lot of um, self-sabotage in the sense that it, I guess it wasn't necessarily um, something that she needed to do was to break off the connection, but it was necessary for her to figure out um, if she wanted what her feelings were for this person because I'm getting she didn't know. Um, so this is for Sagittarius, but this person could be an air sign because there's a lot of swords on the table and um you know, uh, sword energy is very um, rational thinking and logical. And so they tend to um, hide their feelings. So, um, and I'm getting that here with this justice card um, in the two six of pentacles, like struggling so hard to find a balance. Like, oh my God, oh my God, I don't want to be exposed. I don't want to get hurt. I don't want to, um, I, I don't want to get hurt. That's like the main objective in, in, in holding on to your feelings and not letting yourself be vulnerable is protecting yourself from being, from pain, from emotional pain. So, um, she was very, um, like thinking rationally about this situation and, um, uh, just oh, a lot of overthinking, um, coming from her end. And once again, this is funny because I tried to do this reading. This is the second time I did this reading because I couldn't come up with the Divine Masculine's energy. And once again, this reading is all about the Divine Feminine. So I'm just going to let that rock the way that it is because this is but um, the cards were a little bit different. But kind of the same vibe that um, the um, energies were seeking balance. 
and that um, I was getting mainly the divine feminine energy. So I'm not going to, um, I'm going to let that ride for whatever reason. So this is um, about the divine feminine, okay? So maybe there's a divine masculine watching, trying to understand what's happening in his connection. If it is, this message is for you, okay? So the reason that I'm um, sure divine feminine um, walked away basically was just because she didn't know what her feelings were for you and she didn't want to um, hurt you and she didn't want to give you um, mixed feelings mixed signals so she pulled herself away uh, and what she found was heartache with this three of swords and the eight of swords and so um she is right at this time she has the nine of pentacles and she's at the queen of cups so she's found a place where she's comfortable with her emotions and her feelings and she has an, an up she's at a place of understanding about how she feels towards you <coughs> And so I'm getting that she's going to be coming towards you soon uh, with an offer of love. So um, let's get some message cards. Okay, this is a short reading. Let's get some message cards. Just They're sticking. Okay. So um, she has the three of wands. I'm taking a step back and I'm letting um, source step in. The three of pentacles, I'm standing with you. And I have the eight of cups. I'm leaving you behind so that you can learn your own lessons. It could have been that she was telling herself this narrative about you that was incorrect. And so she needed time to um, sort out, like I said, her personal feelings. She was overthinking things a lot um, and just, yeah. And, you know, there's nothing logical about love, unfortunately. And so you come to terms with that and you, um, yeah. So uh, I'm going to leave the reading where it's at. I hope that you loved it. If you feel um, like you want to book a personal reading with me, all the details will be in my box. See you later.